Hello, YouTube fans. Uh, here at Gold Cup Mexico, like, uh, trying to show you how to, how to make, uh, how to convert videos into, so you can put them in your Sony Walkman. Uh, I had problems myself, uh, but I figured out using, uh, a Prism Video Converter, and it worked for me. Uh, I figured it out. I'm gonna teach you how to do it. First, uh, you gotta open your browser, internet, uh, on, on your, uh, uh, on your address bar, you gotta, uh, write, uh, you gotta write, uh, uh, www.nchsoftware.com slash prism. Uh, you and then uh, you click go. Uh, after that, uh, there's you on the web page. Uh, you, there's a link that says download Prism ABI slash video converter for Windows. Uh, click on that. It says run. You gotta run it. Click run. Since I already have it, uh, I just you guys click run, I'm gonna cancel it. Uh, I only tried it with Windows. Uh, I don't know if it works with Mac, but there's a version over here. Uh, download Prism for Mac OS Intel version, or download Prism for Mac OS P PC version. I ha I didn't try those, because I don't have Mac, I have Windows. But after that, when you click run, you uh, go ahead and minimize it, minimize the, the browser. Now you go to your that prism video converter. Um, uh, I'm trying to uh, loading. Oh uh, yes, uh, you gotta first on it says right here uh, on the output format. Uh, it says uh, there's many of them. MP4. You gotta click on the ABI file because Sony only plays ABI files. Click on that. Go to Encore options. And go to that. You gotta go to MJPEG compressor. If it's another one, go to that one. Go to the fifth one. And MJPEG compressor. Click on that. Just go to OK. Uh, then go to edit output. Uh, it's gonna come out like this. Just click on the the one that says resize. Go to Right, 320 by 240, and click down four thir thirds. Uh, shrink and in, in enlarge video to select uh, constraint proportions. Down, just close like that. It's gonna come out like that. Okay, click OK. Uh, so to come out of file, just click Add Files. Uh, go to your desktop or anywhere you have your files, and go to where you have them. And you just open it, uh, and it's gonna come out right there. It's gonna come out right there. So you just click convert, and it will automatically convert it. It may take a, it depends on how long the video is. It may take more, or it may take less. Um, so if you, you can leave a comment and tell me if it worked. If it didn't, I'll try to make another video and try to help you on your questions. So if that's it. Prism video converter. It's free. No, no, no fees. Nothing. Not like uh, I was thinking about it, oh, buying Sony uh, Media Manager Pro for twelve dollars and ninety-five cents, but figured out they have to pay twelve dollars.